honestly, I forget how to speak right now. Uh, it's an indescribable feeling. Edmonton, a team you talk to a lot? Yeah, yeah. Uh, apart from the combine, and I did a couple questionnaires for them, not too much. Um, but just got lucky, and they uh, they liked me. So. What was it like just sitting up there waiting to hear your name called? I definitely uh, feel like I want to throw up up there, <laughs> and it's definitely a big, big relief to hear your name called. What about the whole pro What about the whole process that you've gone through? Like, who do you think of the people that help you along the way? My family, uh, everybody that supported my friends, family, girlfriend, everybody. Uh, my grandpa, literally everybody that I've talked to, my teammates, uh, support from them has been unbelievable. My, uh, my, I'm thankful for everybody that's uh, been with me through all this. Yeah, uh, it's unbelievable. He's uh, one of the best players, uh, or going to be one of the best defensemen in the NHL one day, and I, I bl really believe that. So it's uh, it's really been a pleasure uh, to be able to follow him around for uh, my career in Barrie. And just playing for Marty Williams Yeah, Marty's been great to me. He's uh, one of the best coaches. So. Yeah, definitely evolving as a player. Always, uh, I'm always looking to get better, and I, I see myself taking uh, an even bigger step next year uh, and developing as a, a player and a person. What are some of the areas of your game that you feel like you need to maybe step up a little bit to improve? Yeah, definitely my defensive game. I think uh, it's one of the lacking abilities in my game, and obviously, as a, a hockey guy, you always want to be better and you always want to be the best version of yourself. So. Uh, that's all I want to do is make myself better and work on work on everything. Did you have a favorite player growing up that you tried to model your game after? Oh, I, I've had too many to count. I'd say like Drew Doughty, Kale McCarr, Roman Yossi, ton of ton of guys that I try and model after. Eric Carlson too. Uh, all those guys, right-handed def defensemen, are unbelievable players, and I I really uh, I really try and be like them. How much does it help you with your comfortability seeing that guys like Kale McCarr? Yeah, 100 percent there, and I, I think I'm looking to take that next step and uh, try and evolve it with them. Hopefully, one day uh, I, I'm playing in the NHL uh, alongside and against those guys, so it'll it'll be a, uh, an awesome experience. You said you like Drew Doughty, Brant obviously played in LA for yeah. a with him. Did you, were you trying to pick his brain about? Because I think that Brant came back with more chirps probably like, <laughs> than he probably arrived with. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a little bit. I talked to him. Obviously, he's uh, eighth overall pick, so he knows how how all this goes. And I just try and pick his brain a little bit uh, about the whole experience. Did, did you get a good sense of the two Oilers when they stepped up? Or did you have a feeling that it was your time? I had a feeling. Yeah, uh, it's been a long-awaited journey uh, here. It was last night, uh, not getting picked, and then took a while uh, this morning. Um, so it's uh, it's just honestly, I'm truly honored just to hear my name called by any team. Uh, nothing really. No, he's uh, pretty calm lately. He's uh, he's a real big supporter, and he's just happy that I, I made it this far.